Hey guys, this is Sean from SeanHeather.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to update the software of your HTC One M9 Plus smartphone or any of the HTC smartphone or any of the Android smartphone. Actually the method is going to be very same so you can follow this for most of the Android devices and any of the HTC One smartphone like uh, M8, M9, M9 Plus. So how to upgrade the software of your device? Here is my HTC One M9 Plus. So to update the software, what you have to do, you have to go to the settings first of all. So just tap on the setting icon either from the home screen if you're having the icon on it or just go to the list of all the applications and then go to the settings here. Just tap on it. Once you are inside the settings, scroll down at the bottom and tap on the about section here. Now at the very top you will get the option software updates. Just tap on it and it will start checking whether any upgrade is available for your device or not. So you can see that for my one uh, M9 Plus there is an, so, uh, an update is available. The software update is available which is 455.76 MB in size. So you're now you're having two options to either download it right now or download it later. If you tap on later, your phone will show you this message that when you want to be uh, reminded about this update to download and install on your device. So you can select from 30 minutes to four hours. So it's totally up to you which one you want. Just select 30 minutes, one hour or two hours. And if you want to download it right now, just tap on the download and keep in mind that there is an option update over Wi-Fi only. Since this update is very huge 455 MB, it's better to select the update over Wi-Fi only. If there is a minor update available like 10 MB or 30 MB, you can even uh, uncheck this option and use the mobile data to update your device. And if I tap on download, the device will start downloading the update and once the update is downloaded, it will ask me uh, it will ask you or any user that whether you want this download to be installed right now or later. If you tap on later, so next time uh, it will reboot later and it will do it. If you want to install it right now, just tap on it and your device will reboot and the upgrading of your HTC One M9 Plus, M8, M9 uh, device will be started. So this is how you can do the software upgrade. Let's go back and have a look on more options available here for the software update. So you can even do the auto downloading of the updates. If you check this option, uh, your HTC device will automatically check whether an update is available for your smartphone or not. And you can also select auto update apps. So uh, if uh, this option is checked, your device will automatically check for the uh, updates available for the app and it will download and install them but uh, here we are talking about the system updates so this is the main option we are concerned about auto download system updates or not so let me show you what's going to happen if i am tapping on the download now so there we go you can see the message appearing download software update it's zero percent right now because it's huge update 455 MB so it will take some time but this is how uh, the process works you have to go to the settings then about then system update or software update and then there you will check whether an update is available for your smartphone or not once uh, you find that there is an update available just tap on it it will ask whether you want to be downloaded now or later you can select depending on your choice whether you want it to be downloaded right now or later if you're downloading it right now and after that it will ask you once again whether you want to install it right now or later if you are going to install it at the very same moment just tap on it now and uh, your device will reboot and after that the upgrading of the device will be started and once the process is finished you will have uh, a new os installed on your device so this is how you can update the software of your stc1 m9 plus m9 m8 
or any of the Android smartphones. So thanks for watching the video friends and do not forget to subscribe the channel for more videos, tips and tricks and hands-on reviews like this. Have a nice day.